It's Monday, I guess it's the 11th. Got an American going through. Another one just went through way out here. I think that was it. Southwest, left a big old trail. But here's the sky here, there's the American. It's just nasty, humid, hot. Yeah, this one's following that trail, that southwest that we just laid right there. It's all spreading out. This morning they were just leaving the trails that uh, were short trails and not sticking. Yeah, it's hard to even focus in on the uh, jets because uh, just so much garbage in the sky. All this stuff up over here, some natural clouds out that way. If there's anything natural anymore coming over the pass. Some natural clouds, supposed to get some rain later on this week. We'll see. We did get rain over the weekend in San Diego. They said we got three quarters of an inch, so well, that was good, I guess. But again, I don't know how good it is when. The rain is toxic. This one was there's a trail right there all spreading out. So just businesses as usual. The geoengineered skies. You can really feel it today. Eyes are burning. You can feel it in your lungs. Nasty stuff. Okay, we had three FedEx come through and they were all spraying. One, two, and there was another one. There, see. One, two, and uh, third one there. Three FedEx. That one's going to Memphis. This one here. Where'd it go? That one there. Where's that one going? That one's going to Memphis also. And then this one here. And that's going to Fort Worth. All coming out of LAX, though. And all three trails. Here, there. This one right here. It's hard to make out because there's so much haze up there. This one out right in there. You can see where that crow flew through. And then another one right through there. But it's a mixture of uh, oh, somewhat water vapor clouds coming in, storm system coming in. But you can see they're just hammering it away up there. You can see the trails. You can see the jets leaving them. And you can see how the, how the sun's rising there. It just doesn't... You can see the metallicness in the mixture of the clouds. So... That's what we got going on here today in the Coachella Valley Tuesday. What is it, the 13th, I think? Yeah. But uh, again, you can make those two trails out right there. Right above the power pole, right in there. You can see a faint line. And it's all kind of, and then one, one, two right there. You can see it all along there. And then that's one. Pretty much all blended in with the cloud mixture up there. Toxic cloud mixture. So, they're up there spraying and leaving the trails. Definitely. It looks like they're flying pretty low. Like, look at how this one's spreading out right there. Just adding to that mixture. So those are some pretty thick, thick, toxic trails. And then in between the power lines right here. You can see that one there. Oh, there you go. FedEx at it again. Okay, we've got an American coming through, and it's not spraying. Like all those FedEx that just came through, we're all spraying. That one's going to Charlotte, but it's not leaving the trail. It's right above me, and it's right below the, the mixture up there, right there. And no trail.
Let's see if it turns it on. Uh, some weird cloud formations up there. Definitely a mixture of the toxic stuff and the some natural clouds. And it, what's natural in the clouds anymore if they're completely tainted with metallic nanoparticles? Let's see if this American turns it on. Catch him in the act here. It's flying just underneath the uh, canopy there of the toxic soup up there. Yeah, too hard to keep a track on it when it's that far out without leaning up against something. But it's not turning it on. It's getting right to that gray stuff right there. But leaving no trail. So that one wasn't spraying the aerosols like the three FedEx that just came through were. Yeah, let's see if anything else is coming. Oh, we got another one coming over here. What's that one? Uh, got a Delta. I don't want to pop up. Delta LAX to Atlanta. Let's see if this Delta spraying. Let's see what the altitude this thing was. What was it? What did I say it was? I didn't see the altitude. Not that it matters. Doesn't. Uh, it's just 29,000 feet, so it's fine pretty low. That American would be out over this way. There. Is that it there? No, that's not it. Where'd it go? Lost it. Anyways, it doesn't matter. This calibrated air isn't usually that correct anyways. But let's see if this delta should be right up here. I'm not seeing it. So, I'm at 29,000 if that calibrated air is correct. It should be below this cloud cover here. Maybe it's out this way. But on a day like this, it's hard to find them. Especially if they're not spraying. Yeah, not seeing it, so it's not spraying. It'd be right up in here. But anyways, that's clouds here. And again, just kind of shows how some of the jets come through. All those FedExes were spraying. And then uh, American no trail and then this delta I'm not seeing it and I'm not even hearing it so who knows should be right above me right now but that's the geoengineering going on today Tuesday the uh, 13th of March okay here's Hawaiian Air Phoenix to Honolulu it's not spraying and then there was another one that was coming looked like it was going to San Diego and it would be I don't see it here the Delta coming over but there's one that left a trail right up in through there that's all washed out now oh, and here's a there it is right there and that wasn't on flight radar Oh, and there's one coming through. I wonder what that is. Not spraying. No trail for that one. Oh, and here's one right over the top here. It's heading the other direction. Right there, and that was, I don't think that's on flight radar. Right? Was that crow got? What do you got, crow? Oh, you dropped it. Didn't want it, whatever it was. Okay, so there, one up there spraying, and then one that just came through here, right where this one's heading, you can see a trail. 
going right towards San Diego, going south. And then this one acts up, showing up real good. Just getting ready to go through that trail there. I don't know if it'll show up. So there's one, two, three coming through. That's a delta up there. I can see the bottom of it. Yeah, that's the delta. And there's one just made an X right there. Barely make it out right in there. And I didn't see those on flight radar. The only one I thought, I think I saw was that Hawaiian that was coming through right there. It wasn't spraying. And then uh, oh, there's a trash truck. There goes that delta. Definitely leaving the thick trail up there. I don't know what that other one was that was... Here's these two right here. Okay, that was the Hawaiian Air. And then oh, there's that one. Maybe that was the one that wasn't spraying that I just caught. So a lot of jets coming through the valley this morning. One air wasn't spraying. This delta would be and not over this way right now. But anyways, it was spraying. So there you go. That's the sky here. Jets coming through spraying, and some of them not spraying. They're going through every which way. Four of them came through. Big X right there. There's the trails right along there. Two of them there. Not sure if that was the Hawaiian Air or what those were. And then that one was a Delta, right above the power line there. But they're definitely hitting the valley. It's just hard to see them. And that's all spreading out. So there's one, there's like a triple X right there. Three of them came through. See that halo around the sun? from the metallic nanoparticles. So, definitely de geoengineering the valley again today. In front of this storm system coming in, so we'll see if we get any rain from it. Now looking south, big old trail just came through there, you can see. And the mixture up there went straight above. Right there, all thick and spreading out. So, looking down towards the Salton Sea, it's all socked in down there. So, again, they're definitely geoengineering the valley today. And it's hard to make out, but you can see that big old thick one right there, all the way. Right in there. And then one straight above here. Right there. So there you go. Lots of jets coming through. Spraying the toxic sprays. Got one landing. I always take this route right over the top of here of my business. That's Alaska. They fly into Palm Springs. But anyways, two jets just came through up there. You can barely make it out up there. The haze right in there above the power lines. And then trail are we spreading out and then one right up here spreading out and just kind of blending in with all that other stuff up here and one directly above me just came through. I didn't pull them up on flight radar but they're probably on there. So there they go. Two of them. One right there above the trees. And then that one right there above the power lines leaving that trail. And then Alaska Air coming in and taking this landing route that they take when they're spraying out here heavy. 
they're not spraying it heavy that they take a completely different route and they come in much higher so it's probably to avoid when they're dropping in altitude the uh, chemtrail jets above them that are spraying but we're getting heavily hammered here today it's just under the cloud cover hard to see or in the cloud cover pretty much it looks like most of them they're coming through are right in the middle of it or just below it so it's thick up there and on these pilots they fly through this stuff and they and then they get outside air I posted a, a video on it it comes through the engine somehow and it's heated up and then cooled off so maybe it burns all the nanoparticles out of it but I doubt it so they're breathing the stuff right in the cockpit too.